Hey everyone, Carl Case, Head of Business Development over at Referizer. I'm joined here with Scott Stein. Thanks, Scott. Would love to uh, love to tell the world about where we are and kind of how you got into this. Great. Happy to be here, Carl. Um, this is Restore Hyper Wellness in Boca Raton. Uh, what we do here, we have a multitude of services, uh, essentially for health and wellness, to make you feel a little bit better when you walk out the door than when you walked in the door. Um, the modalities range from uh, whole body cryotherapy, infrared sauna, we have a whole menu of IV drip therapy here, uh, as well as hyperbaric oxygen therapy. I can go on and on. It's for ranges for people from the uh, 10 year old gymnast to the 85 year old um, average Joe and Jane who just wants to do their thing and feel a little bit better. Awesome. How'd you get into owning a restore? Um, my business partner and I, we have a finance background and uh, worked on Wall Street for many, many years. We were introduced to this concept um, that was, is based out in Austin, Texas, um, and we just fell in love with it. You know, we were busy or sick and tired of sitting at a desk and kind of crunching numbers all day long and staring at a screen. And this was an opportunity to get into uh, a business where we're helping people feel better, put sure. smiles on people's faces. Uh, so it's a lot more rewarding than what we were in beforehand. Awesome. So. And when it comes to challenges that you see in a, in a day to day and um, picking vendors to help sol solve those challenges, what do you really look for and, and how, do you, how do you make those decisions? Yeah, I mean, we look for, uh, I mean, for me personally, reliability and availability of the, uh, the vendor is paramount. Sure. Um, if I have a question, you know, I have some experience in a lot of different things that we do here. Uh, the finance, of course, but things like marketing, digital marketing, stuff that we use you guys for, uh, that's something that I always want, I need, you know, if I have a question about it, even if it comes from an area of lack of knowledge, um, I like to get that fairly quickly. Awesome. So that's a, that's a main point of what we look for in the vendors, really the reliability and availability of you guys. And now obviously I'm going to ask when it comes to Referizer, um, <laughs> Tell us about some things that you that you like, some success stories that you've seen, and kind of what for for somebody that's never heard of Referizer or knows who we are, what can, what can they expect? Yeah, we we've used a, a bunch of digital agencies before we were introduced to Referizer. Um, they take care of uh, mostly our digital ads, our ads on Facebook, um, and so on, and, and lead generation. Um, what I find really helpful with you guys, I have a weekly meeting every week with the team. Um, we go, there's about four or five people on the call every single week. We go over what the successes were for the prior week and what we want to work on in the future. Um, so that's been really good. You know, we are optimizing the ads constantly um, to make it um, easily accessible for everybody to, to learn about us and to walk in the door. Awesome. And then when it comes to the support end and kind of expectations that you've had for Referizer, how have we done? And um, what would you say to a, a new business owner that is kind of looking to, to partner with a, a marketing company or, or agency on that side? They've been super attentive. Um, I, again, anytime that I have a question, whether it's emailed uh, to a team that might be in Europe or whatever it is, they instantly get back to me, which is great. Um, there's never been a time where I've had a question or an issue with anything that we've done where it hasn't been answered within 24 hours. Probably awesome. a lot less than that. So, Well, we really appreciate it and thanks so much. Thanks guys. Have a great day.